Power on. Powering on. Welcome, Welcome to, to All Tech, tech Lansing. Lansing. Boop, boop. Dogs are freaking out. Let's let them out. We got energy. Too much coffee today. Come on, guys. Go, go, go. Whew. Today, I'm working on getting those out, cutting the wires of the front and the back. That one's already out, but I'm going to take them out. The lights, they're overhead lights that I can't even use legally because I'm on a school bus. I'm going to paint them white, like prime them, and then... I'll paint them whatever color I paint the bus. And so I kind of like how they look. I don't really want to remove them and delete them completely. So that's my plan. I need to cut all this stuff though and run it back and try to declutter all the unnecessary wires. So that's what I'm going to do today. <laughs> It doesn't start anymore. I fucked up my school bus when I unhitched the emergency door. Won't start. So, <laughs> I got snipping wires, and uh, I know that this was a possible thing, but I took my chances. And I cut the wires to the emer emergency things with the switches that make a really obnoxious noise um, and it won't start now because it needs to be grounded so I have to trace these wires back one of these three or them all I don't know I should have not cut them I knew that was gonna happen Dang it. so these were fine because I cut these four and it still started and then I heard a pop when I cut these so I'm gonna try to connect them and see if it starts. Good luck Liz. Alright I connected them. Let's try this out. So I'm gonna flip that back on. Oh shit. Ah! Please 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 please. Ah! Welcome back. It is day two of the bus not turning on <laughs> but it's fixed yeah the crowd goes wild um it's been a very rough rough uh, 24 hours of my mental capacity and this is really good practice for when things don't go right but um somehow i mixed up the wires not somehow i just was cutting shit but um, connected these two and disconnected those, which are two wires that split into four for some reason. I don't know. But, um, just a bunch of guess guessing and checking on wire configurations and it started. God, it was... We did it. We made it. I don't have to sell the bus. It's gonna stay in my life and it didn't destroy me this week. These are the heroes of the week. I love that sound. I didn't think I'd ever hear it again. That was sad. But we're back up and running. Kick the bus. Ahoy. Today's my birthday, so I'm taking the day off um, from work, from the bus, I'm just hanging out, enjoying being around my fam, and it's been a lovely day so far. I did buy a new set of tools, and it is sick. So happy birthday to me. Love me. I'm just hanging out here. There's a leak up in that skylight, so that's going to be one of my next uh, things to tackle, along with a couple leaks in the windows. I really don't want to take my windows out. I'm taking the windows out. There's a um, screw on each side on the outside and then on the inside. So 
I just want to see how difficult or easy it is to take that out. Got one there. Oh, these are going to come out easy. Maybe. Welcome to a new day! Um, so yesterday, painted the uh, windows and they've been drying overnight. It's supposed to rain in like a couple hours, so I need to put them back in and caulk them real good because every single window leaks. Um, so that's what I'm doing today. After I bundle up, buttercup. Cause it's a cold one. Bus style. So on a new tripod. Well, it's a attachment thing that holds my cell phone. I've just been holding it up on stuff and it's kind of difficult and then it falls and it cracks my screen and so it's like, well, I guess I'll make a five dollar investment. Ready to rock! You guys. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, what? Is that a color decision? No, I don't love it. I like it. I need something a little bit lighter, I think. After caulking last night well I did it like I get it all day to dry and then it was wet clearly and so it didn't set up darn it not really sure what to do because today's the nicest day <laughs> and the next 10 days is just pure rain and my windows are gonna leak now so ah. today taking these puppies out. Not just today, it's taken a while. Multiple days of patience. But... Cool. Another little project I got going on is the headlights that were above, up top, up there, and up there. Um, and in the back, I'm taking them apart. So I'm taking the lights out. Don't know. I think I'll just throw those away. And then I'm going to save these, fill this with insulation, and then clean them and then prime them and put them back in. So it fills the hole and I like the way they look. bleach water. Don't worry, the dogs did not drink the bleach water. Just the hose water. So, got her done. I don't know if people do this or not, but look at all that muck. in my breathing air because essentially it's going to be on the inside of the bus sorry this lighting is rough look at my bus isn't she lovely all right now they're gonna dry and then i can paint them someday i am going to grind down some inside rust today and then get some rust converter on it and then my goal is to get the outside completely primed so I can um, 
I don't know, so it looks better. I just took it for a drive and it, I got some weird looks because it's just looking ghetto. So I'm gonna get grinding. <laughs> I am gonna put some Rustex. Rustex? What's this stuff called? Crud. Oh, it is Rustex. In this squirt bottle, because I have to put it up on the roof. And, um, <coughs> come on. And I have been using just a rag, but I want it to go on thick, so I'm gonna squirt it in this thing. What the heck? Inky. Don't get it on your skin, kids. Actually, kids don't even look at this stuff. It's gross. And then we're just going to squirt it all over the place. And I'll catch the drips with this nasty rag. Oh, that's messy. I don't have a squirt gun, and I wish I did. So use a squirt gun if you're doing this. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to video this. My mask is really dirty. <laughs> Gross. I got all the rust converter on the ceiling. It's sizzling. It's going so I'm gonna get out of here and it's a gorgeous day. So I am going to sand right here, which I haven't done yet. And then hopefully paint the rest of it and get rid of all the yellow. Hey bud, what are we working on today? Huh? Working on shake? Oh boy. Don't be jealous, Ace. It's okay. It is a beautiful day here, huh, Bill? Yeah. Sun's out. Yesterday was the crazy, windy, um, floody, disgusting weather, and today is just beautiful. So I'm gonna do some outside stuff. This bumper needs a little work. So I'm gonna prime, well, I'm gonna grind it and then prime it, and then the front bumper too. Maybe I'll take this thing off and then maybe I'll prime those, can I point, prime those lights, the light covers. Paint day! I primed these puppies too to protect from the rain coming up yet again and now it's onto the front bump. Um, I need to take this off and I need to take this off then I'm gonna grind that rust and paint it. I'm working on taking this puppy out. The bolts are super rusted and so two of them just uh, came off they broke off so I have ice grips clamped on to one side look at that view you got a better view than I do okay so now we're gonna go this way and then the ice grips should wiggle a little bit back Hopefully it breaks off, but this one's not as rusty. I don't know what's going to happen. Maybe I'll grind it off. Oh, there. It broke. See? It's stuck in there. <laughs> cool. And then the vice grips just loosened up. And nice. I have one bolt left. We got vice grips clamped on to that last bolt. Let's put you right here. I need a tripod. All right, got you in my grill. Down to the last bolt. I'm gonna try to just kind of rip it off because I can't get good grip on it with the vice grips. The metal's too soft. Okay, I'm going under. So 
that the bolt I'm trying to clamp on, bro? <laughs> there it is. In all its glory. This is pretty stupid, but... I lost my actual wire cutter, so I'm using my mom's jewelry ones. So we got wet last night, but there was spray paint underneath and I'm assuming it was latex based and then I sprayed it with oil based. So now there's some sort of reaction going on. So I'm gonna sand it down and just try to smooth it out and then do another coat. So I'm up on the roof. Ah, I did a little caulking and now I'm painting, but look at this bug. It reminds me of the big one on Bug's Life. Hey cutie. But I'm painting up top. Well, I feel really bad now. He's trying to spread his wings and he can't. Poor guy. He got stuck in the paint. Sorry, dude. Dang it. All right, so Ding Dong Lizzo ordered a uh, boat hatch thinking it would be a good fan or a good way to vent out my bathroom. So I got it and I'm so stoked about it. Oops. <laughs> but it opens from the outside and I can't use it because I need to be able to open it from the inside and on the outside, it's not waterproof. Blonde moment! Number one of many for this bus. Actually, it's probably not the first, but I'm gonna send it back and I think I'm just gonna build one. I'm gonna build the, um, the emergency hatch skylight up there too. So I might as well just make them both. Gotta send it back. Thanks, Amazon.